a friend of the show, the star of the candidates, you guessed it, Lawrence Trent. He gets white as usual. So d4, no more of the... Really, Lawrence? This is what you're gonna do? Knight c3? Okay. Let me try and play good, solid chess and see what he can come up with. Play this against Jabava in the, the, the world, world Blitz. I got a pretty good position. He didn't go g5, which is probably... Sorry, g4, which is probably a, a good way. He's so confident now. Yeah. So, for the moment, I'm expanding. I also beat Fabiano in a Blitz game in Norway chess with something like this as white. So it's not... It's not completely alien territory to me. Yeah, so he just continues to, to push on quite logically, considering whether to go rook c8 at some point, but yeah, I do get the feeling that uh, that I should be a little more uh, flexible in that, retaining the option to castle queenside at some point, so that's why I'm going knight b6 instead. Intending probably to go bishop d6 next and you know, try to reduce the influence on, of his bishop on, on f4, which could be a pretty formidable force. So I'm sure he's looking at ways to get... b3 feels a bit soft, like... I wasn't that actually even intending to go knight c4. This move was all about preparing. So dc5 is logical in that he makes me lose time by moving the bishop twice. But now... now it feels like I've got a lot of central control. So b4 quite logically... I was pretty happy to force this. He's got knight e4 though, which I didn't see. And he didn't either. Okay, so no more of the queenside castling stuff. I just want to get the, the rook into play. Knight c4, let's jump in. Okay, so he wants to make sure that he does trade off one of these knights, but I do feel like I'm, I'm better here. So there was the threat of knight a3 there. I could have got knight a3 immediately, but then he has c3, so that was nothing special. Hmm, yeah, I got a castle at some point, right? g6 doesn't worry me the least, so he's got to go h6 and then I go g6. And although he has some dark squares, I feel like probably doing pretty well. Could go knight a3, but he can take it. Yeah. Okay. f6. Feels like I'm better developed, so opening of the game should should be a good thing for me. But I gotta play faster. Knight e5. I'm not as comfortable as I would like to be. Okay, let's go for it. Rook c2. Fe, Fe, if queen g4. I gotta have some kind of counterplay there. Wow, he just castled. He's probably done a video series on Alpha Zero and now he thinks he can play like it. Spoiler alert, he probably can. Knight c5, I'm gonna go rook d2 followed by bishop c6, hoping to get d4. And this one, I was not so concerned about. Maybe I should be. Anyway, I gotta play faster. That should be my number one priority here. Yeah, this game is turning out to be a lot tougher than the one I had last time, so kudos to, to Lawrence for apparently improving quite a bit. Hmm. Yeah, at least he's spending a lot of time and he's getting confused now. This one I'm gonna take. Rook f2, there's knight f3. Yeah, I like it. Take the queen. Not a worry in the world. Knight e3. Take the rook. Take the bishop. Made him. Oh, I didn't do this too brilliantly. What am I doing? I'm not even mating him. Oh, finally I did. That was a bit too close for comfort. Well done, Lawrence. I'm never gonna make fun of you again after that performance.